Okay. Hello everyone. Welcome for another X-Wing match XTC. So let's start with this. Start here. Yeah. So you can now bet for your favorite player or country or list. <coughs> Whatever, you have 15 minutes to do so. So, another X Swing uh, XTC related match. We've got on the left Team France with uh, Maxime. On the right Team Serbia with Stefan. Um, so, let's start with lists. First of all, you've got Polo. Uh, the one that must transfer a token of any type to a friendly ship at range 0 2 in th at the beginning of engagement phase. He's equipped with a proud tradition that allows him to perform focus actions even while stressed. Um, then you've got three Zeta Squadron survivors, two of them with Special Forces Gunner, uh, so basically, uh, front and back turret. Uh, when the turret is to the front, you add an attack die to your pool. Uh, when it's on the back, you can perform a front and then a back attack. Uh, and then you've got the last one, the third one, with automated target priority. Uh, which means you must attack the, uh, the defender at the closest valid attack range. And if the attack fails, you get a calculate that you can equip uh, on your next uh, uh, engagement. Finally, TN3465. Uh, you can make her suffer crits to make an opponent at range 01 of her a crit. Suffer a crit. Uh, she's also equipped with automated target priority, so that uh, she gets the same as the, the last of the uh, special forces ties, which means uh, when she uh, performs an attack, she must choose the closest enemy, and sh if she fails, she gets a calculate. Um, on the right, you've got Death Rain. Uh, after dropping or launching a device, uh, he can perform an action. He's got passive sensors, he's got uh, diamond boron missiles, and then he's got thermal detonators, so uh, basically he can drop two, drop one, perform an action, drop a second one, perform another action. Uh, so yeah, he, he is really dangerous with those uh, Diamond Boron missiles, uh, and with passive sensors because he can just like uh, throw the bomb, passive sensors, throw another one, get a focus, and so you you just have to wait that someone enters your uh, your front arc. Then you've got red line, red line uh, that reads you can maintain up to two locks after you perform an action. You may acquire a lock, so you can lock and lock, or you can just like focus lock or anything. And he's got proton torpedoes. Let's mention that those punishers have the uh, recharge action, so you can just like recharge proton torpedoes or uh, diamond missiles. If I am right, so let me just double check something. Uh, yeah, there is nothing that tells you that you can't recharge Diamond Boron. And then you've got Vader Classic, uh, Fire Control System, and After Burners. Alright. Okay, so time didn't start yet. <coughs> So you can see the deployment of both players. So you can choose your champion by betting, if you will. 
uh, blue is left, pink is right, as you can see on the overlay. So I'm not sure what to expect from this game, because I think both players want to have a pretty brutal engagement. Uh, though I'm not sure who's the winning one for such a frontal uh, engagement. And it will be time starting real soon. Let's go. Time started. I really like your overlay. What group round and match plus the current standing between the countries? It should be used as an example to all streamers. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. That's. That's for sure the... Uh, I mean, I'm not sure there is another information I can fit <laughs> on the screen. Yeah, this was the... Um, my um, my objective was to, like, when you, when you go on stream, you see pretty much everything that is related to uh, the games uh, that occur or, like, anything that is related to the group or anything. Um, maybe it's a bit, um, like, uh, uh, I mean, it's, it, it may be little for, like, uh, phone users. Uh, I'm not quite sure they can see, uh, well all the information. But, um, the thing is, I have also some games that, um, uh, fit more than three, four, or five ships uh, on the overlay, so sometimes it overlaps my uh, my information, which is uh, uh, which is kind of uh, regretting because uh, I've got to modify everything. But yeah, okay. So yeah, it seems the game won't be too long before engagement as you can have death rain already um, going towards the right of the screen facing uh, max uh, little swarm uh, also for those who did not see on the screen uh, on the um, title or something you've got a 90 seconds delay which is the lowest delay I can Bit. Uh, I mean the lowest that is allowed by uh, XTC uh, regulation. So um, so yeah, basically uh, we will have some delay between what you are saying, what I am saying back, etc., etc. So don't worry, it will be good. Uh, if the engagement and like all the ships are going to the uh, um, to the upper side of the screen, I will be um, making like a uh, I will be moving the the camera so that we can see uh, a bit better. So Death Rain is going to face the, the swarm, like in jousting or something. Uh, red line seems pretty. Yeah, it seems like it, he's just like waiting. Vader cannot like joust. That's not the point. Um, let's see. I'll show you the, the ships of Max. Shout out to Chewy Power for those real good repaints. Okay, so let me just 
get some coke commentator for the stream. Let's go. It will be joined real soon. Okay. So is Death Rain able to drop two bombs? That's the question right now. Because he might want to do three actions this turn, but I'm not quite sure he could fit two bombs. Okay, so just receive red move ninety uh seventy nine, sorry. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate Oh no, that's Noah, sorry. I mean red moves also, but <laughs> that was Noah. Um Just a bit. There you go. Guess what the Okay. Uh there you go. this seems like Vader has some trouble to decide whether he's going hard or bank, I believe. Just to go dealing with the swarm himself. Might be dangerous though. Good morning, everyone! <laughs> hello, hello. Hello, oh, gentlemen. Here is uh, Pierre, another French player that will be uh, co commentating with me all this round. Comment ça va? I mean, like the guy who will play after. Yeah, also. <laughs> Okay, so turn two. Ooh. Might see some dropping. Yep. Okay, so dropping. Yeah. First one. Hmm. Oh, it's dropping a bomb. Yeah, r rules question here. Um, is if the uh, yeah. As a uh, as I was worried about, if the two straight doesn't fit, is he allowed to drop the one straight, or is it too late? I guess so because it's um, you didn't have to choose before you dropped them. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, so in fact, you have to choose because you may spend up to two. 
to uh, expand it to drop each of them. Um, but as you can't, you may try to use another uh, another template. So yeah, oh yeah, run, okay. Uh, run all of that. So it's not really a, a problem there. I just think you want to avoid. But uh, so, who do you think has the advantage? That's really expensive. Yeah, who do you think has the advantage of uh, going like this to joust the mm. other? <laughs> We'll see. I guess um, if you have done that, you may have commit with uh, all the ships. I mean, uh, broke down. Maybe a two or three ding for red line. Uh, the same stuff for. Uh, ooh. No shots for. Solo. Could end up being really important because he's the uh, the only one. Oh no, uh, it's not the only one with three dice actually because you've got the uh, special forces gunner. But still, it is a three dice attack that you won't have for the engagement. Yeah, and it seems like yeah. red line is going hard, so this will be the first proton torpedo to go. So he may. Yeah, take a focus, and then with red line's ability, take a lock. The question is, who do you choose? I mean, the better is because it's it's the most expensive, and it's a uh, one of them could uh, could fire uh, twice on low agility ship, but uh, mm -hmm. I guess it may go for yellow. Yeah. Yeah, he's doing it. Yeah, I've done that. I may have done a three hard with um with Vader. Mm -hmm. We'll see in a sec. Oh, and then he's got Diamond Boron on uh, Death Rain, which means he can spend two charges, one f to fire and the other one to um, take the effect of Diamond Boron, uh, which is uh, each ship at range zero to one of the one you attacked uh, launch uh, rolls a die. And uh, are the results uh, on a hit or crit? You take the matching damage, and uh, yeah, the rest doesn't count. Which means you've got fifty-fifty. Yeah. It's a splash effect. Yeah. So if you hit, you can spend another charges to to just your damage to all the one. So you want to protect Vader. So that's, that's the uh, single barrel, then you've got one force for a focus, one force for a target lock, I believe. Mm, yeah, seems reasonable, but we'll still be range three. So it means like next turn you are on two force, because yeah, there there is no chance you take shots. At this point, I think Max is aiming at the uh, Punishers. Yeah, there is no... Uh, no way to be shot at... I'm not sure taking Fog there here is, um, is a good call for a second action. Yeah. You may just try to use one force if you need it. Mm -hmm. One at the same time. Okay, so there is holo activating. Oh, you could? You could... Okay, so you've got plenty of choice. You can strain any other ship, which is quite not the good idea, because... Uh, I mean, you, you can strain everyone except yellow, because yellow is the one that's getting shot on this turn. Uh, you can also pass him 
any other token, which means you can break his own lock, or you can say, yeah, he's, he's, okay, he's passing the focus so that he may have two focuses f for defense, or maybe like one for defense and one for attack. I think that's, that, that, that was the, the right choice, I believe. Yeah, it's a pretty good call from uh, from Max, I guess, because he can uh, have both uh, both token. First one is a range three, so if you can avoid to um, to be fire at, uh, so I guess one reroll. Yeah. Um, And that will be three with the focus and one crit. <sighs> there you go. So range three, so three dice for the ISF. And you might as well spend the first focus. That's the reason why you passed him to him. You passed him yeah. to it, sorry. Okay, so now the Punishers. So Holo doesn't have anything, and Redline is about to fire the first proton torpedo. Okay, that's Do you want to be So the question is do we roll it or not? Yeah. Okay, I think by re rerolling Yeah. I go only for one. Okay, so that will be four with the focus. Yeah. Yeah, which live. So you take two no matter what, you'll take three. So all shields down. Yeah, two no shield. Currently, have Spanish focus or currently max. If yellow can survive, I guess you have quite good advantage here. Mm -hmm. So, this rain will use his passive. Okay, so yeah. Activation, passive sensors, recharging, taking the lock. We'll be taking a lock onto yellow, that seems pretty much what you've got to do here after committing so much forces into him. And this will be a diamond boron missile charge. There you go. Thing is, you have only three charges of mm -hmm. the diamond boron, so you cannot. Ooh, that's yep. not a good roll. You will spend it to reroll those. Yep. I mean, he's in a pretty good position because even if he got he gets blocked next round, he can still drop two, get get two actions. So that's that's not that's not a problem. Action economy on Death Rain is not a problem, even even uh, more with the uh, thermal detonators. Yeah, so the three makes. Oh. Yeah, you have to spend it. You have to. Yeah, you, you do not want to take the shot on the dice roll. Yeah, okay. So just one. Yeah. Just one. And then I guess splash will happen. But yeah, what, what I was saying is Diamond Borg 
has only three charges. So you can only use the splash mm -hmm. once. Yep. Because the second will be the missile, but you will be out of charges. Now you see the effect. Oh, it's everyone. Yep. Everyone is getting the, uh, the trigger. So now the most important thing is who... Okay, so yeah, he's pinging. That's really cool for us. And he was right not to take both damage because he would have died. He will die, yeah. Nothing. Uh, damage for red. And then you've got... Oh, that's... That's all? You rolled everything? Okay. Okay, now Max is allowed to shoot finally. <laughs> yeah. Question on who you shoot. Red line. Okay, so red line is worth 63. I guess. Yeah. I guess I will go with, uh, with Death Rain first. Yeah. Because because... Red, line, red Line is pretty It doesn't have the um, Advent Sensor. Mm -hmm. and, and he doesn't have the Proton Torps next turn because uh, Max will be too, sh too close, I believe. Yeah. So first attack did not hit. Second one is hitting with one, so... Death Rain will take, uh, Red Line, sorry, will take one. There you go. Um, that's two coming from green. And that's one on uh, Red Line, second shield down. Yeah, it's, um, oh no, that's on Death Rain. My bad. He's now switching targets. Yeah, yeah I know what he's doing. Yeah, yeah, you have to commit to the same. Oh. Huh. Uh, difficult. Choice. One, but victory. <laughs> Okay, it's going into red line once again. Ooh, two crits. Ooh. I mean, that won't change anything because he's got shields, but that's scary for sure. And yeah, only two blanks. Yeah, but you, it was a range two shots. So yeah, I've only run oh. dice to roll. Mm hmm. Was range too short. Uh huh. Uh, the thing is, uh, yeah, no. I would, <laughs> I could call no. the captains, but no, no, we won't do that. That's up to the player yeah. to call, uh, to call the judge or to um, yeah. to understand that they have done uh, something. Is Max isn't. Um, committed to his game, that's their fault, and that's it. Okay, so now you've got red line with no shields left, you've got death rain with one shield uh, down this turn, and on max side you've got the um, yellow Zeta Squadron survivor living on one, but now uh, Max has got plenty of space to uh, come and block the two Punishers. I assume Vader will be the main problem of next round, because you... Yeah, Vader will 
will be safe, I believe. Because you, you, you want the Punishers, because this is the heavy uh, weapons of the list. Though Vader is not ridiculous, but like Proton Torpedoes are scary. Oh, and... Yeah, I, I don't think that you won't commit too hard into um, into Maxim's um, Maxim ships. You know, um, so maybe Max has a shot here to try to block Vader. So maybe doing just one bang or one forward to avoid having all uh, all the ships firing at him. Yeah. Uh, but it could also turn the other way, you know, and uh, avoid avoid to be hit and coming at the back, recharging his throws. Yeah. I mean, there are still like 50 minutes in the match, so <laughs> you've got plenty of time to do whatever you want, because they engaged really yeah. fast, so... So that's, yeah, but that's a decision you have to take now. Yeah, Let's yeah. Say, I'm changing all my ship uh, to to the swarm, or uh, they won't. I was, I was thinking about a, maybe a three bank with a yellow. SF because you would probably end up dodging Redline's arc, maybe Death Rain's arc, and maybe Vader's arc as well. And you could hit yeah, the back. I think it's, it's pretty hard uh, to, be, um, to be shot. That's what I say. It's depend on uh, what the fighter will do. If we commit with a one bank, it will have uh, the yellow, but Max could also do a three hard try to block Vader mm -hmm. from any action, and that might be uh, hard for the for the Serbian player. Okay, so it seems Max is ready. We are waiting for Evan. Holo is probably doing a blue maneuver, but yeah, he's got like a real good blue uh, dial, so that won't be any problem to uh, to erase the uh, the strain he has right now. The uh, the main yeah, it's the back, but that rain cannot do so many things here. Yeah. Um, me fact drop a bomb to barrel wall and then come oh. in up front red line do something like that oh yeah uh, but the swarm will move first so if the swarm move just in front red line will bump into uh, oh yeah into red line and red line will bump to swap those Oh yeah, you're right. That could be that could be a thing. Because you, you use your first action I mean you drop one, you target lock, you drop a second one, you barrel, then swarm moves, then you bump onto red line. So you've got a shot on the one you uh, you target locked, then red line bumps into death rain, which means he also has a uh, shot, and then you've got Vader moving, and hopefully for uh, Stefan not bumping, not, not for Max obviously, and then you could have some kind of a good turn for the Punishers, but yeah, that that will be like some smart uh, system phase plays <laughs> to avoid being blocked on both uh, both Punishers. Will be an interesting turn. I mean, the fact that you can barrel roll with the Punisher, 
it, it's red, right? It's red barrel. Yeah, it's red. I mean, oh, you could also boost. I forgot about that. You could boost target lock. Oh. So you could. Yeah, but red, red line doesn't um, can uh, do that. No, no, it, not red line, but. Might, yeah, but yeah, that's rain. Yeah. I mean, ah, you you could end up blocking the whole swarm. I did not consider. Uh, can you? Uh, I'm not familiar with the Punisher. Can you, like, drop one, do a focus, then drop another one, do a boost, and then link it to a target lock? Yeah. Ooh, okay. Now that seems interesting. But I guess you can do that. From my perspective, it might be better. If you do that, you might go on the block with the boost. And then uh, I do a 4K turn. So drop two bombs. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right. There is also this possibility mm -hmm. where you don't stress oh, yourself, yeah. Yeah, don't want to, st to be too stressed, but yeah. Doing something like that, it could be end up blocking a uh, swarm by this boost. It seems like we are going. To system, first bomb being dropped, and it will be a focus as the first action. So Max is helping Stefan because um, he is uh, new, relatively new to TTS, as he mentioned earlier. So uh, Max is helping a bit. Um, so first bomb and a focus. And then second one with the two template. So that's the third thermal dropped on this game. And what will be the action? Now is the time to think. So it will be a boost to the right. And will he link to a target lock? Is he thinking about it or not even considering it? Okay, that seems like he's not considered. Okay, so you 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 are correct. He might be going with a 4K, or at least try to go with a 4K. Yeah, because I don't think it will pass. It might go because you have pretty pretty big ass with a uh, Wizard's Punisher. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, it's medium based, so you you have to uh. To consider after the template, you know all the space yeah. uh, that you have. But, um, I don't think it will. It will pass. It will be very closed for sure. Okay, so yellow stays here and will rotate the arc as he believe he can. Uh, as he believes he can see maybe Vader and then double tap uh, Death Rain or uh, Red Line. Yeah, he might be safe for this turn. Mm -hmm. uh, Vader. Ooh, so, not shoot at so TN is bumping Red Line. Death Rain? Ah, oh, I keep confusing them. Uh, it's Death Rain. Yeah. It's easy. Red line is red. <laughs> yeah, that, that's, that's true. That's true. Okay. So, oh, green and red are both bumping. Yeah, I'm. I may have bumped red. And death ray is ready to avoid to avoid any any chance for the key turn. But yeah, he's bumping. Yeah, and he is dressed. So let's just show the maneuver dial. Yeah, blues are yeah. What you can expect from such a uh, 
So yeah. Bomber. Dang boost. Uh, action. Red line with one bank. Yeah. We may fire. Uh oh. Oh, I mean, the, yes. the good thing about Death Rain doing the bank boost is you cleared the space for Redline. The problem with this is Redline is taking four shots. <laughs> Unmodded, but four shots. Yeah. Let's I mean, see. five with Let's yellow, see. actually. But... Oh, you could barrel roll and try to initiative kill yellow and maybe go out of like uh, maybe at least one arc I'm not sure that is good but that's a possibility I believe yeah that might be as a small play uh, but I believe he is going oh no do not take a target lock take a focus yeah I take focus and target lock the thing is he want to fire his... But he, he did not take the focus, right? No, he did not take, he just took the target lock. He forgot about the focus. Yeah, he clicked on the focus, but uh, doesn't seem to... Oh, so, okay, so he did it, but the focus is not here. Okay, so... Yeah, it's... Yeah, it's missed click, I guess. And Vader is doing a one bank and bumping onto yellow, which means yellow is safe for the round, as you said earlier. But uh, Vader still has arc on plenty of ships and will be able yeah, to choose but, his yeah. target. He will take the target from, from, yeah, from red line to avoid being torpedoed. Yeah. And send it back to yellow. And then that's the spag. Nothing to. Yeah, yellow is safe. All the turn. Um, I think the red line will be a problem next time because it will drop a bomb into everyone, I think. Yep. The last uh, thermal so will hit pretty hard. We'll have guys to that shot. But if you have done a three hard to block Vader, why not come and kill Vader? So that's all. Yeah. Okay, so. Uh, it looks like Vader is shooting, but to whom? That is the question. Uh, two dice, this is an SF. This is safe. Yeah. Might be red. Might be red. Because after uh, red is a uh, the thread. <laughs> <laughs> so hollow is. It's two. It's ooh, one hit for crit. So as hit one crit go through. And this will be both. So it's So one, two, one, two, red line, and the crit is uh, disabled power regulator. Okay, not relevant for this turn, but it will be for the next one. Uh, yeah, it is because uh, it will take an ion directly here. Mm -hmm. So as you engage, you take an iron. There you go. Who do you shoot at? I guess red. You take yeah. red range one to have one more dice. Yeah, that 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 the, 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 there was the focus that did not appear. Oh, well, that's. That's a good shot. I mean, I believe Death Rain will probably die here because of TN things. Yeah. So, might as well spend. Yeah. 
that well. So that was on red, as you said, and this will be two hits Ooh. and a crit. And the crit is weapons Weapon failure, which is quite relevant right now. Crit. Weapons failure. Failure, there you go. That's a... Okay, so this is uh, TN. So two. Nothing, so two more. One, two, he's two away from dying. Yeah, it's six and three, so yeah, two away and dying, of dying. I guess you fire with red and then to green at the mm -hmm. back. So this will be only one, but you could do a crit, and he will do a crit. So shield on yeah, TN. If it doesn't roll and evade, he dies. He actually takes a crit. He dies. Yeah, so he dies. And he will have two shots, green and yellow, mm -hmm. on that brain. So, hit and crit. What is the crit for the record? Is a direct hit. There you go. Uh, who is shooting? Is it green? It's green. Oh, it's, it's green. green. Uh, this will be one more damage. There you go. And then yellow. Oh, range 2 as well. Yeah. Or one. Just for one. Yeah. But this time it will be okay. evaded. Right. Right. Yes. Old story. Let us come to this angle. Next round. Just go like here so you, you can see what is going on. All right, all right. So basically, you've got the whole swarm possibly facing Vader next round, which is kind of dangerous. And you've got Death Rain possibly dropping his last thermal detonator, but won't be able um, to. Uh, yeah. yeah. Death Rain is out of the game for at least two or three turns. With this. Miss, uh, Miss Catern, <laughs> I'd say that too. Vader might be in danger right now because you cannot afford to lose Vader without Vader taking is the best target for sure. Yeah, you, I don't see Max, uh, Caterning all the swarms to fire at her. I just had to death rain, we will oh, flow back, try to reload. I think it's um, maybe a good idea for him to reload. Yeah, because um, I think when you reload thermal, you can reload up to two, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. But do you reload thermal or... Oh, diamond? yeah, or diamond bro, diamond. yeah, that's a good question. I mean, th there's debate, right? Because thermal allow you to perform like all up to three actions a turn, 
and Diamond Baron are your um, your weapon, your true last weapon, except the Vader, because yeah, two dice from a Punisher with a lock or a tar with a lock or a focus that won't matter. But Diamond Baron are important piece of uh, of uh, of uh, Stefan Stefan list, so might consider it. Yeah. So is the bank, one bank to the left, uh, clearing? I think it, I think it is. I think there is no, no chance you go out of the map by doing a one bank to the left. Yeah. Even with a three, it will still fit. Oh, the three. Oh. Yeah, but the, the three doesn't clear it, so it will. Yeah, yeah, for sure. One uh, one bank just to clear up the stress. I mean, in this position, you drop. Oh no, not maybe maybe not because you've got Vader like maybe coming to this side of the board. So maybe yeah. you don't. Yeah, Vader not you could not not out turn. You know, on the... so it's kind of difficult. Maybe hard turn two. That will be facing uh, the asteroid, mm -hmm. the debris that we have on the left. And uh, if you're coming on the right, you will not do so many things, though. I don't know what Stefan will decide. So, red maneuvers on the X1 are 3 Talon and 4K, is that right? Yeah. Yes. The problem is with Thai SF, you are in arc even though you are behind them, basically. Except if Max didn't consider the the maneuver, but I think he he will for sure. Um, might be in danger because I mean there there are several possibilities for Max in this position. You can uh, hard turn to the right and hope to make Vader bump. Uh, because he went uh, to the right. You can also just K-turn or sloop with those uh, FOs and SFs. And then if Vader went fast, you catch him in the arc. You are not modified, but even even with no damage and making him spend, spend sorry, uh, the whole force, you just like destroyed his force economy, which is kind of the first step to Making Vader, uh, uh, making uh, making Vader take uh, some damage. So there, yeah. there are several possibilities. That's true. Yeah, he will have to so to bank to focus. I'll try to shut. Oh, we could target lock. I think it's yeah, good. I don't know why focus is still good because the focus provides you also defense. So there is no point for him to just take back the target lodge. Yeah, there is a debate right now. Is taking the focus very hard from the end. Blocking too hard to the left, uh, maybe one bank. Uh, too hard to the right, sorry. Maybe one bank to the right. And, uh, might might clear if he does a one bank. Though the. Um, I think like Tien right now is not. Is probably not expecting to bump, but to be at range one. And there will be a lock on Vader. Oh, that will bump, which is no good. But that will clear. And the question is, do you rotate the arc? No. You just clear that. So, if Vader bumps, because Vader um, turned the right, um, you just bump into red, so mm -hmm. no point. 
Yeah, but with with uh, this uh, Death Rain not dropping this turn, I believe Vader is going straight fast, or maybe K turn. So Death Rain yes. did a one bank. He is now in position to reload, as he will not be able to shoot anything. That is for sure. Yeah, I, I still think Max. Yeah, I guess too, too hard. On um, on Holo is the right move. You may have done three, but if you have done three and then Vader K turn. Uh oh. Yeah. Uh, anyway, just for Death Rain, it was a reload action. He reloaded. He reloaded. Um, Diamond Baron Diamond. missiles. So Holo took a target lock by taking a strain and then took a focus as his uh, action. And Vader is doing a five straight. He did not want to uh, K turn this turn. So you could just barrel out of Green's arc, maybe? Or do you accept the position, stay here and just take a focus, maybe? Oh, he's gonna have burners. Okay, so that's one charge. What will be the direction? To the right, okay. So we pretty much know where Vader is going next turn. Hard to to the left, to the right, sorry. Vader boost. No, it doesn't have boost as a engagement. Yes, uh, no. Yeah, three and a barrel. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He will take a focus, so there will be absolutely no chance he uh, takes a damage, and then he will use a force to move his own lock to do not move it to hollow, do not do the same mistake twice. <laughs> uh, you've got everything except yellow, and he right. chose red. I mean, I believe you keep the strain with Holo. Yeah, because you've got the uh, the bluest of all <laughs> maneuver dials, so there is no point in giving uh, this. So now, basically, you've got the whole swarm uh, that has a pretty clear um, engagement line to death rain. Because they can all hard to and be facing uh, Death Rain's position. Which is quite good because you could like easily uh, take half of the ship or maybe in two turns like just erase the ship from the map. Yeah, but Death Rain has a hard to, he may, he may try to kill Red with the... Oh, with the Diamond Baron, yeah. I'm not sure it's the right thing, to, at least to commit in red. What 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 would you do with Vader? Because like, uh, you could three turn afterburners and take action, etc., etc. You could also three Talon after burners and you would be closer to the fight because whether you choose to go on Vader or Death Rain uh, with this, the FO Swarm uh, you will be you probably will be able to shoot Death Rain this turn but you won't be able to shoot Vader uh, if you are not uh, slooping or K-turning or whatever because of the position of the ships, I mean, they are where their arc is pointing. So Vader might be in the in a safer place than Death Ring. So 
I don't know what I would be doing. Because you can know you, you cannot ignore Vader because you would like suffer very much from it. But on the other hand, you cannot uh you cannot deal with Vader this turn, so it's kind of a complex choice, I believe. Hmm. Maybe turning on the left. So, um, FOs have um, two sloop. Is that is that right? And SF yes. also. I don't um, remember the. Um, let, let there me... is SF and three sloops. Nope. Mistake. Yeah, you're correct. SF with three sloop and FOs with two sloop and four K turn. Hmm. Okay, so everyone is good right now. Uh, there will be a drop, the last thermal detonator. We are at zero charge. There you go. So what will be the action? Oh, he took a focus. Did not notice. He took a focus for that. And now this is... Yeah, okay, so Max is going hard to uh, to death rain. Yellow is making a sloop. TN, three hard as well. Take. Debating whether it takes an evade or a focus. Yeah, you have to take. You have to take focus. I took evade here. Green doesn't have an action as he pumped. Death rain. What will death rain do? Too hard as expected. Too hard as expected. Target lock onto red probably. It won't pass him. And then the one heart B is sufficient. Not sure what pass for all of Yeah, I mean you could well, why not why not go in on passive sensors, but anyway you've got all the targets. And the one heart on hollow. Target lock and a focus. Yeah, probably. I believe you are out of Death Rain's arc, so. Yeah, but Death Rain will. Hmm. It could still. It could still, as he is passive, try to target lock yep. Holo, but there's less chance to hit Holo. Yeah, for sure. I don't know why you take a an invade with uh, with TM. The red SF is a target here. Yeah, that is correct. Yeah. So you have to maximize your uh, your damage. Wait, long turn. Only. Okay, so he took a deplete. Uh, I mean, I think this is going to. I mean, you 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 could still take a strain and like give it to anyone but red. That that won't matter. But don't take a deplete. I believe in this situation because yeah. you are. It doesn't make any sense. I yeah. don't know what to think about. Yeah, I, th I think the strain here is the good option. Oh, he's 
He's rolling out of fat. Okay, that's. Oh, he doesn't want. Maybe he to doesn't be. want uh, to be uh, to to suffer the uh, bonus um, diamond boron effect. Yeah, but you will put him on a not so good direction mm -hmm. to. Okay, so Vader is doing the three hard, did not want to uh, be um, talent rolling. There will be the second afterburners charge. Yep, going down. Afterburners, there you go. Afterburners are out. Then he may be bare rolling. There you go. I believe you will only have green which is not oh maybe 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 not even yeah see i think i think he will have green so that was the first action then you can spend two force to target lock and focus i believe you do not have red i think this might be difficult oh maybe he did not take the strain because he knew i mean yeah no i i think that the correct choice was was the th the strain and transfer the strain to uh tn because now he's got a deplete that he will have to uh to take care of and oh tn was in range of vader okay maybe that makes sense now i don't know So you could, and, and red is in range as well, but I don't, I'm not sure you want to be uh, taking shots, taking the target lock to red. Okay, so he is taking the target lock to red, okay. And taking a focus as well. well. Try to deal at least one damage and maybe fire at green. Yeah. Does it have any shots? And yeah, the, um, okay, sorry, uh, the train is only taking the lock uh, to its initiative, so that is the reason why. Okay, and um, red is taking uh, Holo's focus. But yeah, okay. yeah, that, that was the problem. That was the, the yeah, thing. Yeah, uh, but doesn't have it in art. Yeah, so. that, that's the. Yeah, that, that, that was the reason why I was expecting him to take the target lock on green and not on red or a TN. I mean, TN was in arc, but I'm not sure this is the correct target. Okay, but still, this is a two dice and green is taking a shield. So Holo is taking a shot, deplete shot, so only two going through the, uh, the debris. Doesn't have any focus yet, so nothing at all. Death Rain engages and he is taking a lock. Red, if you. There you go. That's not too good. Let's re-roll everything with the lock. That's way better. At least one going through. Anyway. Yeah. It will uh, hit down, she dies. She dies here. Yep. What is the crit for the record? Focus. I guess it will feel weak. Hull breach. Uh, so red dies here with a hull breach. Hull breach. Hull breach. There you go. <clears throat> Not that it is important though. And what? Why did they come back? Oh, because you've 
What? Did not take the damage. So red doesn't take anything. Green takes uh, a crit. So he's on one shield now. So yeah, there you go. But that's not the same crit. Oh man, okay. That was... Uh, okay, so... Never mind. Um, feds. What, why is uh, Tien not rolling the dice? Oh, but it, yeah, it's the same agility. I forgot about that part. It's the same agility. That is the reason why. Only ships. Same order. Yeah. That is the reason why. So, two dice from Tien. And we'll do nothing as she took an evade. Green is engaging, taking his uh, calculate, and we'll do two without the calculate. Maybe Death Rain could evade everything. It's range two or range? No, it's range two. It's range two, it's okay. Range. So he takes one. Yeah, and he takes yeah. one. So there you go. So Diamond Boron are at zero right now. That's yep. really a good turn for Max here. Yep. I still don't understand why he has taken this deplete. Um, I mean, the barrel put him right now in a tough position. Because you have debris. Mm -hmm. Yep. You roll for debris, which only took crits. I mean, um, what, what I am. Um, uh... What I am seeing right now is Holo doing a one hard on the next turn because he's got proud tradition, so he like kind of doesn't care of the debris. Although he might take a crit, there is always a chance. But he may be able, he he will be able uh, by going through the crit, do, through the debris, sorry, uh, to take the focus with the proud tradition. Yeah, problem is. Yellow here. Oh yeah, yellow is probably yellow, dying. It is in a bad situation. Yeah. Um, it doesn't have any es escape plan. Yeah. yeah. And the thing is, the 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 game is really close because right now Max is ahead by one point sixty three to sixty two. So any mistake could. And yeah, up, it's uh, one field green. You have so Vader just have to. It's green for one shield, and it's yellow for one hole. Mm -hmm. And Stefan takes uh, forty more points. And he takes it like almost for free. Because I, I don't know how yellow can resist a uh, target lock um, focus shot from Vader. And green is like doing the same. The, the, the thing is, three damage are done onto Death Rain. Death Rain cannot double or triple action anymore because he doesn't have bombs on his. Uh, uh, I mean, bombs available, and um, so basically his uh, escape route is blocked by the, the the gas cloud, but the position is not that bad because you force Max to think about whether the Punisher is going through the cloud and escaping uh, real fast, or going um, to the right with Bank, maybe. Two bank, three bank. I mean, it will still go over the cloud. That's pretty much sure. But you've Max. Max must decide whether he uh, commits to the um, the edge of the board or still goes like straight with uh, SF and TN. Maybe TN is doing a one hard to block the possible four straight. Uh, so yeah, you you've got to think about what uh, Stefan will be doing most likely because you could end up with a Punisher taking no shot which would be 
uh, a disaster for uh, for Max because if he escapes right now, he can like next turn reload, for example, and be like double uh, double uh, recharging bombs and double dropping the next turn. I mean, yeah, with five minutes left, it's probably the the last turn. So yeah, maybe not, <laughs> but. There are some possibilities. The one that sees the mat, the must, uh, the mo the more options will be, uh, will be probably winning the the game right now. Chen is also at one now. Uh, one health from uh, from giving half to. Uh. Death rain? No, that's two on death rain, right? Tian, Tian. Oh, yeah. Okay. My bad, my bad. Yeah, Tian, yeah. One away. Uh, I mean, yeah, you would score 15 points. But, yeah, well, why not? I mean, if you... if you, So, death rain is worth... Uh, death rain's half is worth... Uh, uh, twenty, 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 twenty-eight, I believe. So if you take two halves, you probably take twenty and yeah. If you take green and yellows halves, you win the game, even if you lose half of death ring. Twenty-eight. Yeah, that's twenty plus. Yeah, okay. So if you if you take both green green half and uh, yellow's kill, you take the game. For uh, for Stefan, so Max has probably. I mean, the, his only plan probably is to keep his advance, or to try and uh, take half of um, Death Rain, but without losing anything. Uh, I mean, without losing both uh, green and yellow, I mean. Oh, so now, if Death Rain is going through the cloud, this is looking marvelous for Stefan. And, oh, and he is... Does he have Arc on green? Oh, that's... Not sure. That's real close. No, I think not. Oh, man. But anyway, there will be no shots on Death Rain if Vader kills Yellow. <gasps> Vader will probably kill Yellow, which means uh, Holo will have to half Death Rain, or the game probably is lost. Or am I missing something? Or is it correct? No, no, no. Still have two minutes. Thank you. Sir. Uh, yeah, you're right. There, there, there. Uh, yeah. There probably will be a last turn. So you take the lock. Vader is committing all force to take a lock onto yellow, probably killing him if the dice are... Okay, so Holo is passing stress to the green SF. Is it the right choice in this situation? Because now green... Yeah. Yeah, could uh, could reach it. Could turn. Oh yeah, you're right. Okay, turn. Death Run doesn't have any choice unless to go through the gas cloud. Okay, so now you FCS this. Or yeah, you killed him. You spend the focus, and he dies. So yellow died. There you go. So now he is leading by uh, 19 points. And yellow won't have a shot onto Death Rain. Holo is the only one shooting. It is through the debris cloud. Three again, three. We'll do two. Oh, he might take half. If there is no evade, he takes half. There is one evade. Yeah. So only one damage so far. 
Okay, so Death Rain yeah, has a shot. Turn. Yeah, we can fire at Tien. Tien is not obstructed. Wow, this is amazingly Death close. Uh, doesn't seem. Doesn't. Oh man, he if he would have taken green, that would have been. I mean, you you could have called game here, just on that. So now there is a slight chance, or maybe time will run out too short because there are only eight seconds left. I believe this will be the end of the game as the roll. I didn't see death rain roll for the gas cloud. Oh, and you are correct. He should have rolled for the gas cloud as well. But anyway, time did run out. Oh yeah, you're right. This could have ended up mattering because of yeah. the strain on the. Yeah, you are you are correct. Yeah, and he is saying this to him right now. Yeah, he rolls. Gets the strain, so. So when when you are starting this again, you just roll re-roll the defense dice. Yeah, you. you, you have to yeah, you do not rewind to the attacker. Oh, yeah. Okay. No difference. Still taking only one. Which means the game is over, and even if Tien doesn't take any damage, this will be uh, Stefan winning the game? Yeah, that seems it. So that was one hit on Tien. Yeah, yeah, the evade. Yeah, yeah, she's got the evade. So anyway, this will be evaded. Yeah, and this is the end of the game. I mean, you can shoot with green to Vader, but anyway, you could yeah. do two, and Vader is on three. Oh, yeah, well, <laughs> maybe he'll take two. <laughs> okay. Hit. Yeah. So it's four dice the other side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But anyway, if he loses two shields, that won't matter, so... And there you go, two evades. Okay, that seals the deal. This is... a win. For, uh... Yeah, yeah, lead 3 to 1. That was really, really close. And they've got the same score as we do, which means 82 to 63 for uh, Team Serbia on this uh, game. Um, okay. Got the same. Did I update everything? I sure did. Okay. Well, I believe. This is the end of this game, so... Uh, yeah. So yeah, I'll just update the score. So, score, there you go. This will go to 1-3 for Team Serbia. So anyway, in just about uh, 20 minutes, we've got another game and the main actor <laughs> for the game <laughs> is you! <laughs> I try to do my best, but it's a hard matchup for me. Yeah, it sure is. We believe in you. France believes in you. Yeah. You shouldn't. <laughs> I don't believe in me. <laughs> Yeah, so anyway, I'll, I'll let you uh, prepare for the game, so thanks for co-commentating. That was a pleasure having you. See you soon. Yeah, see you. Bye.
Okay, so for the remaining viewers, let us uh, get you the prediction. Okay, so bettings. You bet for Max. Oh, so who did bet for uh, Stefan? Dr. Diminisher. Let us, Stefan, one. I I'm truly sorry if I did pronounce his name uh, bad. Uh, oh, all my uh, apologies. Uh, I'm trying my best. Uh, Dr. Diminisher and... I don't know who who the other was. Uh, I, I can't see. I can't see. Okay, anyway. Um, thank you for watching the stream. I hope you liked the game. GG to, C to Team Serbia winning this uh, fourth game and ending up uh, being at three points, which means one away from victory, which is really important. There are two match points right now. Um, okay, so uh, anyway, for us, we are coming back for another round in about 20 minutes. Uh, so stay tuned. I will close the stream right now because uh, there will be uh, uh, there will be uh, like. It, it will be more convenient for uh, VODs. Um, so anyway, thanks for showing up. Thank you to everyone for coming. And I hope to see you tonight as well.